county government of Migori has rolled out a 40 million shilling empowerment program aimed at boosting the economic potential of its citizens at the grassroots level. The program promises financial grants to formal groups in all 40 wards of the county. Brenda Nyongesa with more. Migori County is embarking on a major empowerment initiative under its County Economic Empowerment Plan. The program, which is being spearheaded by the County Executive Committee member for Trade, Tourism and Cooperative Development, Betty Samburu, will see 40 million shillings disbursed as grants to benefit communities across the 40 wards in the county. According to Samburu, the funds will be distributed to 10 formal groups per ward, with a specific focus on empowering women, youth and special interest groups, such as persons living with disabilities. Each ward has been allocated 1 million shillings with a breakdown that ensures 50% of the beneficiaries are women, 30% are youths, and 20% come from the special groups. We are targeting 50% women, 30% youths, and 20% special groups, including people living with disability. In the committees, we had a, a youth Gen Z representative in each of the wards. We had a person living with a disability representative in the committee, and we had women in the committee. Each ward has been allocated one million to benefit the ward. He said this is a ward-based program at the grassroots and meant to benefit the very vulnerable and down there at the group. Recruitment is already underway at the ward level with committees working to identify the groups that will benefit from this initiative. County Secretary Oscar Olima emphasized that the program aims to uplift local communities by enabling them to create and generate wealth at the grassroots levels, ultimately improving living standards for rural dwellers. This was, has been executed through uh, a bill that was passed in the assembly to empower and give uh, uh, financial empowerment to various communities and various groups within the county. Uh, this one, the governor is doing as part of the fulfillment of his uh, election, uh, or rather manifesto, to empower and economically energize uh, less uh, able communities within the county. As the recruitment process continues, the Migori County government remains hopeful that this initiative will drive economic growth and improve livelihoods for the targeted groups. With the funds said to be distributed soon, many are optimistic about the positive impact it will have on the grassroots levels. Brenda Nyongesa, KUTV.